it's been really an encouragement for me to step out in my faith. It's really challenging, it's really tough. Um, but through that, you get some really cool experiences. I feel that people's hearts have been changed and been touched in the, the different you know, scenarios and situations people are in. Um, and I think that we've really made an impact. It's a feeling, it's a vibe that you get when you meet other people, when you help other people, uh, when you get involved in a team and you actually go out working for the same issue. The local church here is really helping people to work through some of those issues and build better lives. I met a woman uh, just the other day doing detached work, went out and she was feeding pigeons and I went up and I, I felt I was called to go and speak to her and even if it was not to say anything else but a thank you and she told me that you know every time I come to Southwick I will feed the pigeons I'll go on out and I'll buy some food and I'll feed the pigeons because nobody else does no, nobody else sees it as their duty she felt sorry for them and it's that little act of kindness if not to someone of an equal standing to us, if not to another person, but to something that we see as vermin. She's kind of just help them. He really wants us to uh, take a step of faith and boldness to do these things. Um, but this week has been a very encouraging week for prayer, for really like surrendering everything to him. week we've um, been going out on the streets and learning what it is to um, trust a little bit more in God by stepping out with the Holy Spirit um, and asking him to give us pictures and giving us words which has been very scary at times um, but also been really exciting because we've actually seen that God to guide us to certain people. We've also run a number of events and invited people to come into those events so that we could get to know them better. Uh, we had a, a fantastic quiz night which went down really well and uh, there were some great conversations happened in the midst of the quiz. Uh, we've had a course on happiness and uh, a course on, on healthy eating. All of us, whoever we are, have got some good news to share and we share it sometimes by speaking in different places or by acts of kindness. You don't have to be set in standard ways, just whatever you're most comfortable with, as long as, as, long as you're uh, speaking to people, sowing seeds of faith. I felt um, that we have some, touched some lives and planted some seeds and, you know, shared our love for Jesus and, just, you know, a bit about what God, what God is about and his, um, what he has for these people in Southwick. Mission doesn't have to be scary. Um, God just wants you to do your little bit in your little part of the world. God is already at work in the community in Southwick, but he's pretty much gone before us. So we were just building on the work uh, that he is doing there. And there were some tremendous stories of faith, people who had a belief, but perhaps who weren't involved in a local church. 